Business now and the construction of Mombasa Nairobi transmission project at Maria Kani Power Supply Substation is 94% complete. Energy and Petroleum Cabinet Secretary Davis Chircher today toured the power supply substation to inspect the construction works. The CS says once complete, the station will support the infrastructural flow of power from Suswa to the coast region and reduce the over-reliance on diesel power plants like Rabai. The power station will bring some 400 kilowatts to the coast region at a cost of 142 million shillings. The CS says the government is focused to push more geothermal power to the region and retire the diesel generation. The CS says this will have a great impact on the efforts to reduce the cost of power. Means you, the bill will come down. The fuel charge today on our bill is about 40-60 uh, ratio uh, compared to particularly because of the long drought. So if we can reduce the fuel charge, which is a pass-through cost to, to the customer, that will go down. The substation will also have a tee off to um, Dongokundo, which is our economic zone to facilitate acceleration of development of the special economic zone, which is basically our, um, our hubs, our, our development, our manufacturing hubs, which will also facilitate employment of our young people and basically push us up the GDP to uh, manufacturing to GDP, maybe from the current percentage of seven to nine to what you have seen my colleague Moses Kuria talk to wanting to move to 15%.